So today guys, I will be teaching you how to configure a router as a repeater. So basically, a repeater will repeat its the signal of this modem. And the, the router that I use is Tenda AC1200. And based on my experience, um, it, it has a stable connection. So a Wi-Fi repeater does not need a direct UTP or the untwisted pair cable but instead it uses a wireless signal from the modem okay so let's try it to our router my internet connection here is built DT fiber but if you have yours as well you just need to know the password of this modem okay so let's try with our router Currently, this is the device that I use as a repeater for my Wi-Fi connection. But you can also use other brands as long as you click the proper menu and the items inside it. So you just have to access its IP address and you will be redirectly uh, redirected to the interface of this router. So let's try plugging it in and then let's see how we can configure it as a repeater. As you can see, there is a light here, which means that I've already uh, plugged in the router. And now let's type the IP address of this router. 192.0.1 But first, as you can see, I am currently connected to another connection. So it basically, it will not um, redirect me to the proper address since I'm connected to a wi different Wi-Fi name. Now, let's enter this Wi-Fi name and as you can see below here, it says no internet connection. But since we've logged in already to its IP address, then now we are redirected. The only downside of this router that I bought is that the characters here are in Chinese so now I'll be typing the password and now I've entered the interface of the router currently guys my Google Translate is not working since we don't have an internet connection but let's just try to navigate here where the uh, repeater boot is so since this is the status, this will be uh, the configuration. So let's click this one. So I think this is the one because I can see the near Wi-Fi connection. So the, the nearest is this Wi-Fi, which is the name of the Wi-Fi modem that uh, we have configured. And it has 78% signal strength. So let's try to click this one. We will be repeating the modem using this signal. I think it is asking for the password. So I'm gonna type the password. So that's will, that will be our password. And then click OK. So it's now establishing connection to our um router the tenda ac1200 so as you can see it's now loading as you can see from no internet connection it has now a internet connection because we are previously connected to constant to this wi-fi name and let's just wait that the Wi-Fi name for this router will show out here. So let's just wait. So it's this Wi-Fi name. So let's try to connect to the Wi-Fi name. So as you can see, it states here that it's already connected and secured. So let's try to go back to the interface of the modem 
to know that it's working we just have to type this uh, use this translate page so it's not working because we have no internet connection and as you can see from this signal I've successfully connected it to this router okay since we are connected already to the repeater let's try its speed okay so there are um, and types of speed here it's fast.com you can also speedtest.net so this is my internet connection Guys, um, by the way guys this is the beauty of stable router because it can actually provide you with a much better speed so it can amplify the speed of the modem that's for my observation so we have this connection 110 mbps and up upload um, speed is 130 mbps so that's it guys and if you have questions you can drop it by the comments section thank you